And then, out of nowhere, his smile hits you like an avalanche of rainbows dipped in the sweetest chocolate. Wow, isn't that wonderful imagery? I think that shall be the resolution of 2009. Create better imagery with my words. I want to create scenes. I want to create things you can visualize. I just want to be able to say something in the person just to be blasted into a dream world of amazing things. So I'll do my best. At this stage, you're probably completely unaware, but I am actually in a new room. Um, if you know that I'm in a new room, then of course you wouldn't be completely unaware. But if you're just looking at this video, like, this white wall looks just the same as any other white wall, I suppose. Um, but I have actually moved below my house. So that's amazing. Outside, the wind blows like a giant fan the size of Mars would blow wind across the galaxy. Little pieces of dust float like fairy dust, but not magical. The trees bend like a dancer would bend if it was bending. The dancers bend. I suppose like uh, um, ballet, ballet dancers bend. Oh, of course. What are you saying? Like all dancers bend. Okay, I should actually say something of importance. Probably I haven't done one of these in a while. Um, I kind of miss chatting to you guys. <laughs> Isn't that nice of me? So basically, what's happened is Christmas has been, and then New Year's Eve has been, and then New Year's Day has been, and then the third of January has been, and you know, so on and so forth. We've had quite a few days. Um, but what's important is that today is today, no matter what day you're watching this. Over the um, Christmas and New Year period, I was deep frying mushrooms. Isn't that exciting? So basically I was standing over a giant container full of boiling hot oil. Well, actually, it's hotter than boiling, 200 degrees uh, Celsius, which would probably be about a billion Fahrenheit. So basically, I was standing over them, or over it, or them, if you're talking about the particles of the oil, or just it, if you're talking about the oil as a whole, and uh, throwing in mushrooms dipped in tempura batter, flipping them around a bit till they were cooked, and then serving them to people. So that was fun. I'm looking at my notes down here. Um, I've got notes that I write for YouTube, and I haven't, like, I haven't added to them in quite a while, so I've got I've been going through my old older notes. And a note that I have here is um they're just like dot points and this one is Iceland moves roads for elf houses question mark. Does it, does anyone live in Iceland? Can you confirm that? Like I don't know where I heard that from. But obviously it caught my attention. I think we should move off that topic actually. So I'm currently sitting on the carpet here. I have carpet! For the first time in my life I have carpet, people. I've always just had, like, wooden floors. But now I have carpet. It's quite exciting. Although, I'm dreading the vacuuming. I quite like sweeping. I don't think you can really sweep carpet. But anyway, back to what I was saying. I am sitting on the carpet and next to me... ...is a bag of cement. I'm really not sure where it came from or what its use is. But it's there, so that's what's important. Do you like my tie? It's pretty pretty nifty, eh? I don't know if you can see. It's got like, kind of looks like stained glass. I thought I'd dress up today. Um, in fact, <laughs> I was inspired by Sean the Welsh Leprechaun. You see, the problem with inside jokes is that most people don't get them. And that brings me to a slight dilemma I've been thinking about. Should I include in jokes? Does that make people feel excluded who aren't? who aren't part of the crowd. So I think the idea is to make a happy medium between in-jokes and just regular things. I was about to say regular jokes then, but I'm not really a jokes man. Um, the other thing, of course, is the green pig. I mean, I just thought I should bring that up. Look at this hair, it's crazy. I'm gonna do something about it. That's it for now. Don't forget to be awesome and stay updated for more things. Probably not giant vlogs like this anymore. I think I'm gonna try and keep them to a minimum. Um, I've got a short film on the way, a bit of variety, we'll see. But basically until then, just keep smiling. <laughs> um, it's the easiest thing to do, I've found.